Hi uh, guys, how are you doing? My name is Dagon Hannes. If you have been following my YouTube channel, you know that I have been posting more videos about Python and Amharic. Uh, I will be I will be continuing that uh, series, and I'm gonna start a new series as well, which is Python in English, and this is gonna be the part one of that series. So first, let me explain what programming languages Python are. Uh, so you have a language that you talk with your friends with your siblings with your mother with your teacher with your father and many many more uh but what if we wanted to talk with the computer that's where programming languages come in programming languages are a simple way that we can communicate with the computer or let it do the tasks that we want it to do so a uh, programming language there are many 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 programming languages uh you might know some python javascript c C++, Rust, uh, Go, many, 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 and the very popular ones are Python and JavaScript. So, Python is very simple in syntax. Syntax means how you write the code and how uh, familiar it is or how close it is to English. And uh, it's very easy to type in the code and it's very useful. So, JavaScript is actually used uh, almost everywhere. Now, now, you're watching this video. The, with the help of javascript because this youtube website really needs javascript for some uh, functional stuff for functional stuff means when you click a button what happens is uh, controlled by javascript so how does programming languages help us so as you know you might uh, as you, as you know there are very billionaires that are really masters of software engineering bill gates mark zuckerberg Elon Musk, uh, Jeff Bezos, uh, and there are many more too. So they have learned software engineering really deeply. So they they have created Facebook, they have created uh, Microsoft, they have created Windows, they have created Amazon, they have created YouTube, they have created many many more using programming languages and software engineering. So. But that's the real uh, usage of programming languages. So, I have picked Python uh, because it's very easy in syntax, very easy to write code on it. So, in this video, we're gonna I'm gonna show you uh, how to install Python and how to uh, and writing your first line of code and running it. So, let's get started. So, to install Python. You have to open up your web browser. As I said, I have linked down the link in the description. I'm going to be using Chrome throughout the series if there's anything you need to install. So open up Chrome and then go to python.org. As I said, I'm going to link it down in the description. Check it out. So after your redirection to this website, it's going to be looking like this. So after, uh, so uh, as it says over here, it says downloads. So hover over that. Then download the Python version. For your operating system, I'm going to be using Windows throughout the series. So, I'm going to click on Python and the version. It might change. Uh, it might change uh, when you're watching this video, because I have already installed that. I'm not going to click on that button. After uh, after it's installed, it will look like this. Then click on Python, the version, and what bit it is. After it opens, after it opens up, it will say like this. Uh, Python, the version, uh, the bits, and then it says install now. But before you click on it, be sure that you have checked this. Add python.exe to path. Click on it and click on install now. But I have already installed it, so I'm not going to install it again. So after you have installed it and went through the process, open up IDLE. So click on Windows and then IDLE. And then it will open up this it's going to be looking like this so we're going to write our first line of code hope you're very excited so uh, the first line of code if you have might if you uh, my, uh, if you might have seen other tutorials it's going to be print hello world as you see it has printed back hello world let me just explain what this line of code means there's print and then what to print then you, you type it in inside here then it says hello world and then there's another way you can run python code you just don't have to write, type in it's always 
here so let's click on file new file then hold it like this and then make it side to side so it says on title here and that's because we have not saved it so we're gonna say control s go to wherever place you want to uh, you want to save that and then give it a name i'm gonna say first uh python in english story say whatever you want it, do it really does not have to be what i said so let's print a shape so let's print triangle so we have to what we have to do is say print and then go over here uh maybe about five spaces tab in one space let's start over here like this and then like this uh so because we don't want to type in print so many times i'm just gonna decrease the space and then print again go over here say slash and then space then print again slash over here straight line print space slash straight line and now the triangle is finished so what we have to do is underscore we have to do underscore so it's it looks like it's finished so now let's run as you see it has drawn a triangle for us so this is the end of our first python tutorial in english video so thanks for watching like subscribe if you have any questions or suggestions comment have a nice day